What's going on folks, Stormwolf here, and today just some uh, post-commentary gameplay with Xenoverse 2, and in celebration of the announcement that Super Saiyan Blue Vegito and Fused Zamatsu are coming out for Fighter Z on May the 31st, I decided to jump back into Xenoverse 2 and play with these two characters. The first character, obviously, as you can see now, is going to be Super Saiyan Blue Vegito. Now, from my memory, if memory serves me correctly, I think Super Saiyan Blue Vegito is one of the best characters in the game, if not the best characters of, in the game. The last time I played, the best characters was uh, Super Saiyan Blue Goku, Hit, Super Saiyan Gogeta, and I want to say um, maybe, uh, I think I already said Hit. I think those are three or four characters that I remember being like really strong, and I think also um, Final Form Cooler was also really strong as well, but it's been a, a hot minute since I've played this game, so I don't really remember the tier list or like the stronger quote-unquote cheap characters in the game, but um, the reason just kind of, again, playing this, just kind of touch base with the character, kind of see how he might play roughly in um, Fighter Z. I know he has a lot of multi-hitting combos and stuff like that. Um, I'll throw up the trailer in the description if you want to check out the, like, it's like 35 second trailer, which is one thing I hate about Fighter Z and their trailers, like they're so short and they show very little. But I think they also did like a stream showing off a lot of his gameplay. So I'll, if I can find that, I'll throw that in the description as well. And you guys can check that out. But from what I can tell in Fighter Z, he's going to be a really strong close range character with lots of like multi hitting attacks. And I think his three ultimates are a, um, I think it's like Savage Strike, which is like the instant transmission um, punch that uh, has like a blue, uh, like blue aura around it, which he used against uh, Zamatsu in the, in the fight in Super. Uh, the beam sword or uh, the spirit sword he's gonna use a variation of that and then the ultimate attack is of course the final command man which I think you can do on the ground and in the air and I think it's a level 3 super and I don't know if it's like uh, you can charge up to be level 5 I, th I think it's just strictly a level 3 super that does a pretty good amount of damage and it seems to be really easy to hit from the video but this is probably one of the characters I will pick up and um, kind of put on the team probably as my uh, my starting character his assist, I believe, is the um, is a scatter shot, which is like he takes the five fingertips and like puts energy around him and then shoots him out. Well, it seems like a pretty decent assi assist to kind of cover like uh, parts of the of the screen. But of course, you can drag and dash towards any key blast like that. So we'll see how it goes when the when the match actually starts and whenever we uh, get more gameplay of that and whenever I do more gameplay videos and stuff. But I will be playing as him on Tuesday as well as uh, Fuse Zamatsu. I'll probably uh, stream a couple of hours of me training and then going online, probably um, find a couple player matches, maybe find a friend or two to play and practice with the character. And if I have enough time, I'll also do like a, a separate videos for the characters to kind of show off their special moves, their strengths, their weaknesses, and some combos that I was able to figure out with them. So expect to see some of that next week. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy that kind of stuff. Again, this is just kind of like the new stuff that you'll be seeing in terms of new content on the channel. Uh, more post commentaries like this, breakdown videos of fighting games that I'm playing, or just like discussion videos of, of things that are happening in the future so this is just part of the new format that's going on moving forward if you haven't seen that video the reason why i'm doing it i'll link that as well in the description you can check that out but i'm gonna leave you guys enjoy the rest of the gameplay i believe it's uh two more matches after this if you guys want to check it out maybe just one more it may only be three matches that i recorded but um next time you see it, uh, a video it will be a merge to matsu which is going to be a little bit harder because uh that character is pretty difficult to play but you know, win or lose, I'll throw up the matches and we'll do a little bit more of a post commentary and I'll kind of give a brief description of how he's going to play in, uh, in Fighter Z because there's also been a 30 second trailer that was out for uh, Merch and Matsu as well and kind of shows a little bit of what he can do. And he seems to be a pretty interesting character as well. So hopefully you guys enjoy that and I will see you in the next video.